Hello friends, Radhika Ravi Kumar here. So welcome back to my tutorial. In this tutorial, we will see what is the difference between union and union all. This is a very common question that is asked in any interview that you go at the beginner's level. And um, I hope most of you guys would have experienced that. And it's very simple um, and very simple to remember. So it is just a video for the people who are still at the very beginning stage of SQL, learning SQL. So let's start. So when exactly we will be using union and union all? That also you will come to know once we are in the process of discussion. So first of all, whenever you are having number of tables, multiple tables, uh, and you want to club those tables and see what are the data that are available in, you know, in those table. At that particular point of time, this union and union all will come into use. So I have these uh, tables, sample tables that I've created. It's a very simple one. Uh, select start from test and uh, test one. You can see there are 13 records in the test and uh, eight, eight rows from test one. Okay. So first let me use the uh, union and show you how the record is displayed. Okay. Select star from test, union, okay, and uh, select star from test 1. So you can see here there is around 10 rows selected here, right? So what if we are using union all? So I'll show you that as well. Select star from test, union, all, then say test 1. You can see 21 rows are selected. So here itself it's very easy. You will come to know what is the difference between union and union all. So union all is nothing but it will show you all the records that are available in test and all the records that are available in test one. So if you see in test we had around eight columns, sorry eight uh, records and in test one we had around uh, I guess around 13 records and that's the reason we are getting totally 21 rows. So that's union all. It shows all the records. That's very easy to remember, right? Whereas when you remove this all, obviously it's going to be, it's going to eliminate all the duplicate records in the table, test table and test one table and the clubbing all the, uh, both the tables, whatever duplicates are there. It will remove all the duplicates and it will give you only the unique or the distinct records. And that is, that is why we use union. So hope you guys understood these two differences. And, um, Another thing is I want to uh, share about union and union all is which is faster whether it is um, union versus union all which is faster among these two uh, it is very simple um, union all is going to be faster it's a basic uh, you know sense uh, why because uh, obviously union all is going to display all the data that are available in both of the tables or the multiple tables or the table that you are going to use whereas union it's going to eliminate the duplicates it takes time right so first it's going to sort the records in the table and then remove the duplicates and then display the value whereas union all doesn't work like that it just displays whatever is there in the table just like that so that's the reason union all is more faster than union Okay, so this is a very important point and hope these kind of questions, minute question that, that can be asked by the interviewer. So uh, that time you need not stammer and easily uh, tell the answer just the way how I said now. So hope the, uh, this video was very useful for you guys. So uh, as, as I say all the time, please keep supporting my videos and uh, share my channel with your friends and colleagues and um, thank you very much for watching the video i'll come up with some other new topics in sql or pl sql soon thank you mm -hmm.